just don't think that's what he meant. That's exactly what he meant. I think everyone should just own all the consoles. No, so I think you're being a bit Batman silly. Comes out or something special. And I think we should just get on with the review. <laughs> Every now and again, a familiar theme song rings out in the GGSP offices, signalling the return of one of gaming's greatest mascots. Ah, oh, yes. What song is that? Come on, Darren. No, I'm... We're about to review Mario, so I thought you would sing a Mario theme song. What song is that? Mario! Yeah, well, that's at least da, 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 da. from the right game. It's from Mario, it's from Mario. It's when you go to the, the jazz level. Yes, Mario is back in New Super Mario Bros. 2 for the 3DS, the follow-up to the popular Wii and DS titles. After traipsing through 3D environments in his last adventure, he's now returned to his 2D side-scrolling roots. Guys, calling this game new is a bit of a stretch. I mean, it's really just more of the same, isn't it? I feel like the series is really relying on nostalgia to try and keep players involved, and after so many trips back to the Mushroom Kingdom, it's hard to find anything that's actually new about this game at all. I know what you mean, and I know the story isn't a huge strong point when it comes to Mario games, but literally 20 seconds after you've finished saving Princess Peach and Mario and Luigi are waving goodbye, this happens. What are you doing, Peach? Why do you keep getting yourself kidnapped? Oh, I know, she's some bodyguards or learn to defend herself or something. Let's give her a fire flower or anything. Absolutely. The rest of the game is full of the usual bright and cheery action we've come to know and love from the series. There are heaps of well-crafted levels, lots of secrets to discover, and of course, those tight platforming controls that feel better than ever. There are six main worlds, with an additional three bonus worlds adding up to around 80 levels. And while many of these revisit the usual Mario environments like snow, desert and lava, the levels themselves are all cleverly constructed with plenty of puzzles and secrets to discover. I do think if you're an old-school Mario player, a lot of the shine will start to wear off with this one. And I don't think the power-ups were really up to scratch this time around. Mm, and we should mention that the new spin on the game this time is coins. Lots and lots of coins. Each level is filled with more cash than we've ever seen in a Mario game. As you run about collecting these shiny discs of gold, the game will keep a running tally with the ultimate goal of reaching one million coins. As such, all the new power-ups are focused on increasing your wallet size. Gold bricks stick to your head and shoot out plentiful amounts of money, and the new golden flower makes everything Mario touches turn to gold. Oh, so many coins. <laughs> the problem is, 100 coins still equals an extra life, so by the time I had finished the game, I had 120 extra lives. It's hardly challenging. Yeah, especially with that white, invincible tanuki leaf making a return. I and mean, if you die too many times, you can just use the suit to fly through the level. Where's the challenge in that? I think the developers of this game are are assuming that Spawnlings aren't very good at games, and they are very good at games, and I think they could have something much harder and have a much better time. Yeah, it's like they've tried to aim it at a really young market, but then underestimated the fact that Spawnlings are really good at games and don't need something this easy. Yeah. Hmm. We should remember, however, that for any Spawnlings out there who might not have played any games from the series growing up, these assists will come in very handy when it comes to teaching them how to play. Well, that's true, Darren, but that's why we have difficulty levels in games. You know, it's a fine line, a fine line, I think. But this is a very well-constructed game. There's no denying that. Mm. To add to the longevity, there is now a coin rush mode that allows players to race through three random levels collecting as much as possible. You can then compete against other 3DS owners using Street Pass to see who has the best times and scores. But unfortunately, there are no leaderboards to show off my amazing high scores. Another addition which we have seen before is co-op. If another friend has the game, then they can jump in via Wi-Fi and play as Luigi. But I don't know, I just found it so chaotic trying to play in co-op on that tiny screen. Yeah, I'm glad it's there, though. 
But the 3D doesn't add anything to it here, not like it did with Super Mario Land 3D. But we should wrap this up, Hex. Final thoughts? You know, I'm so conflicted because this is such a well-made game and I love Mario, but I just, I wish they'd bring something actually new to this series. And you know, that next Wii U title looks like it's gonna be even more of the same. So, I don't know, maybe next time Peach can go and rescue herself. I'm giving it six and a half. Yeah, that Wii U game, I had played a tiny bit of and it did just feel like 2D Mario with some touchscreen interaction, but it also felt quite fun. Like you say, it is a well-made game. It is also very short though, only a few hours if you race through it. I'm conflicted too, Hex, but I'm gonna give it seven. Well, while I can respect your well-constructed arguments, I feel I must interject. Mario veterans might not like this game, might, they might not find it challenging, but for younger spawnlings, they might just find that Mario still has the Midas touch. I'm giving it eight out of ten rubber chickens. All right, well, thank you, Darren. Can he do that? I think he just did. Affirmative. Thinks he can do what he likes sometimes. Affirmative. Why don't we just Why don't we just go home and you can you can do the goodbye by yourself? Don't put ideas yeah. in his head. Why don't we do that? Let's you know he would do, do that. Let's go. Darren, like. can, Darren can do it by himself. See, Darren. I can bring in dirt. My chair. With me. Really? Some other robots. Mm -hmm. I don't need a chair. You can take it. Bye.